Hi, it's Andy Ninja 1979 for another instructional video here on the GTA 5 instructional channel. And today I've got with me a good friend of mine, Dylan. Say hi, Dylan. Hello, I'm Dylan 3703, and my channel's FMX F21. Yeah, and today we're going to talk about the Pariah. Pariah is really the staple vehicle in the game. It's actually been the fastest vehicle forever. Oh, how though? We've just had a bit of a debate as Dylan's car seemed to have been a bit bollocked up. So um, he's just restocked it all. So. I'll let Dylan talk about this because his, his forte is cars. Oh, and sniping people. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um, so this car, it costs 1.42 million on Legend of Motorsport. And it's probably the best investment in this game that I've made. Um, it is the fastest sports car. Not a lot of people know about it because everyone thinks the more expensive the car, the faster it is. Which is a load of crap. Uh, this car is only a two-seater. If it was a four, that would be amazing. It's got uh, a lot of customizable, uh, customizable options, and that, that's about it with the car, really. Uh, it beats a lot of other cars that are fast in the game, yeah. and that's all there really is to this car. Well, we're going to use it as the benchmark against all these other top cars. It's been in the game for a while. I think it was one of the very first sports cars, wasn't it? There's uh, something like that, yeah. It yeah. was it, it was introduced about halfway through uh, right when racing got added to the game. And that's when more cars and more DLC started coming out. Mm. Uh, I don't think this was part of the DLC. I think this car's been in from the start. I can just double check that now. Uh, we're uh, going to have a bit of a drag race in a minute. His pariah versus my pariah. And the funny thing is, they're exactly the same. So they're both top spec models. Um, and it um, really is just who's got better launch control and Dylan's a smart ass so 9 times out of 10 will win anyway and he'll explain to you how to do the double clutch because I still haven't got it right <laughs> <laughs> uh, another quick thing to add to the video guys if you get yourself on GTA now the Ocelot Fryer is on offer for 923,000 so if you, you haven't got as much money as most people uh, you can definitely pick that up at that price and it was part of the Doomsday Heist um, just to add Okay, cool. I think I think the good thing about it is, is it's like the benchmark that we're going to use for for the test. So if you turn around, we'll do a sort of a straight drag race with both the same car. What we're going to do now is when we do our videos, we're going to be driving. Um, I'll be driving the new vehicles, and Dylan will be using the Pariah because everything now, all these super sports cars as they come out, we're going to show you how they compare to the good old faithful and trusted Pariah. So here we go. As you can see, mine's in better condition than Dylan's because he likes to break the fucking glass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, very true. Uh, uh, right, yeah, okay. I, I, I had a bit, on the, a bit of a crash on the way back, so um, I'll just, just count again. Yeah, it's probably easier. Yeah, I'm not so we're both going to start from wheel spin to make it right, and on go we Three, go. Three, two, one, go. So technically these cars are absolutely the same so it's just it's between me and sort of dylan really who's got the better start i also did not double clutch to make it fair because andy doesn't know how to yeah exactly so there you go so that's I mean, uh it's, it's all about the launch <laughs> yeah with, it is uh, when you're racing the same car because i mean if both cars are maxed out they're the exact same in the game's code and um, so there's nothing you can really do to edit that uh, exactly okay guys Where that is, is going to end uh, another one of our videos and we're going to start doing a lot more on all these different cars and uh, don't forget like subscribe and uh, share retweet and absolutely everything else and don't forget to hit that bell icon and we'll see you again soon on the next promotional next promotional what am i on about it's not a promotional video is it the next video on the channel take care